whether you've just gotten an iPhone or you've had an iPhone for a while. Are there times you wish you knew more about it and how to use certain apps? Our next guests, Nikki Belzer and Maggie Samp, will be joining us over the course of several months with some tips and tricks that will help you be more productive when using your iPhone, whether you use it for work or play. Hi, I'm Nikki. And I'm Maggie, and we're part of Sheraton Valley's wireless support team. We test out some of the devices, and we also help troubleshoot any problems that anybody might have with those devices. And today we're here to talk about a Facebook app and how apps help you with your day-to-day -day activities um, and also how to upload a photo using the Facebook app. And there's tons of thousands of apps available on the App Store and Facebook is just one of them so we're going to walk you through on how to download an app from the App Store. You're going to go to the App Store and you must be logged in with an Apple ID and password. Search for Facebook And once you find it, you can download. And once the app loads, you can tap it to get into it. And you'll have to have a username and password for Facebook to log in. And if you don't, you'll just go down to the bottom where it says sign up for Facebook. And Facebook allows you to uh, share photos with your friends and with family and also share status updates. Facebook is wonderful on keeping up and, and connecting with family members and friends. I personally just recently connected with one of my cousins. It's been over 20 years since I would have been in contact with him. So it was nice learning how to um, interact with him on Facebook. And Facebook is the most downloaded app from the App Store. Over 1 billion users use the app. First we're going to upload a picture that's already been saved on our phone. and. Then we'll take a picture and we'll edit it and upload it. So we're just going to go in here and choose a picture that we've already got on the phone. And for this example, we actually have our Sheraton Valley logo. And it uploads really fast. See? And now we're going to um, take another picture. And for this one, I think Nikki and I is just going to do a selfie picture. And a selfie is when you turn your camera around so it takes a front-facing picture instead of a back-facing picture. Sometimes it takes a minute or two for it to fully upload, but once it gets fully uploaded, you can go in and edit the picture, or you can delete it. And you can also change your post where only certain people see certain things. You can go in, like for this picture, maybe I just want my friends to see it. So for that setting, I would have anybody in my friends list. It's how I would post this picture. And the other one, I might let everybody see it. So that would be a public profile picture. Okay, after your picture uploads, then you can tag a friend. Which means what? Which means that they're going to see that you've taken a picture. You wanted to make sure that they seen a picture. And the picture will show up on their page and they can choose to share it with their friends or not. And that's how you upload a picture to Facebook. And that's how you upload a photo to Facebook. We've done this today using one of our most popular phones, an iPhone 6 Plus. And if you have any questions on anything concerning Facebook, you can always contact one of our retail wireless stores They'll help you download apps from the App Store or any questions you have on your phones or how to use Facebook. Uh, they're always willing to help you. Thanks, Nikki and Maggie. We look forward to many more helpful tips in the coming shows. Are you tired of not having enough money to buy things you want? Kim Kendrick, Branch Manager and Vice President with Regional Missouri Bank in Salisbury, has helpful advice for saving money now so you have it when you need it later. Income taxes are on everyone's mind this time of year, and something useful in regard to your tax obligation and your savings and retirement plans is to make a schedule to make sure you're funding these options accordingly and appropriately. For instance, with a 401k that may be offered through your employer, take some time to review your pay 
check and make sure that the deduction for this is the maximum you can make. See if you can afford a little bit more if possible. Your employer often matches a percentage of what you add to it. So it's a great way to build those funds safely and securely and have that resource when you need it. Another way is to review your options for a traditional IRA or a Roth IRA with your banker or your tax preparer. It's a great thing to do. It saves you some taxes, can it, either now or in the future, and it's a good way to build that savings base that you need, that you will always need sometime. Come in handy. There's no time like now to open a new account or add to a current account. If you get a tax refund, you can use those funds to open an account or add to a current account. If you'd like to set up an automatic deduction for the future withdrawal monthly to a savings account or to an IRA account, that can be done very easily. It's very efficient, it's done automatically, and what we say is out of sight, out of mind. Thanks, Kim. Always good advice. We would like to bring the thrill of the slimiest award show to you, our customers. Sign up for a chance to win one trip for four to the Nickelodeon Kids' Choice Awards 2015. The four-day, three-night trip to L.A. includes tickets to the show, round-trip airfare, ground transportation, and hotel accommodations. So for full details and to sign up, on, go to the address on the screen now until the 23rd of February. There's a limit of one entry per calendar day per person per household. So go ahead, sign up, and we are very excited to offer this opportunity through our membership association mm -hmm. with the NCTC. So many will enter, only one will win. Good luck. Yeah, absolutely. Carousel Productions is hosting auditions for The Kid and Kate's Old West Wedding, Monday and Tuesday, February 23rd and 24th, from 6 to 9 at the Royal Theater. For auditions, improvise a person or situation of your choosing, or they can pick one for you. Performance dates are April 16th through the 18th and the 23rd through the 25th. This interactive dinner theater is sure to be entertaining. For more information, check out Carousel Productions' Facebook page or call 660-651-2311. Helping to fight against litter in the Show Me State, school classes and groups can join in the fight against litter by participating in the Yes You Can Make Missouri Litter-Free Trash Can Decorating Contest. First place winners from each competition category receive $200 awarded to the schools. All first place winners are then eligible for a grand prize trophy and $600 awarded to the school. This is a free contest. Participating schools need to submit an entry form online and up to three photos by Friday, March 13th. Visit the website on the screen for more information and to register. The Macon Baseball Association wants all kids ages 5 to 15 as of May 1st interested in playing summer softball and baseball to sign up this week, February 19th and 20th, from 6 to 8 at the Macon Elementary School cafeteria. Adults interested in coaching are encouraged to apply at this time. Get your tickets for the Father McCartan Dinner Theater in Marsh Lane. The hilarious cast of characters take the stage with five performances. Saturday, March 7th and 14th includes a dinner. Friday nights, March 6th and 13th are performances only. This year's play is Alter Ego. Tickets are $20 and are available at C&W Hardware in Marceline or by calling 660-349-9807. A matinee will be held on Sunday, March 15th. Help Wanted. Macon Municipal Court is looking for a deputy court clerk. Application packets are available at Macon City Hall and will be accepted until the position is filled. The Best Western Motel in Brookfield is taking bids for some interior work throughout their facility. Work needed is as follows. Minor wall repair, drywall repair, and painting. So contact manager Renelda Billingsley at 660-258-49000 for inquiries and or to submit a bid. Bailey Brothers Collision Repair is seeking a full-time employee. Visit them for more information or pick up an application at 444 Meyer Street in Brookfield. Employers, let CVTV help you get the word out about job openings within your organization at no charge. Email your openings to the address on the screen. Give the gift of life at the Red Cross Blood Drive in Moberly on February 24th at MACC from 9 to 2, or February 26th at the Central Christian College of the Bible from 2 to 7. If you're experiencing issues with your computers, either at home or at your place of business, Sheridan Valley has a team of certified professionals ready to assist you. Call 660-395-9000, option 3, and we will provide you with prompt, professional, and affordable service. CVTV has many exciting upcoming shows this week, including Macon's Craft Fair, Another Senior Moment, JP's Pizza Oven, and Women in Egg Conference presentation by Sarah Herrera, Missouri Surprises. Check out our weekly lineup at cvalley.net. 
Also check out CVTV's YouTube channel for all your favorite CVTV programs at the click of a button. Simply click on the YouTube icon on Sheridan Valley's homepage. As you celebrate your pets this week, our quote comes from philosopher Martin Buber. Animals' eyes have the power to speak a great language. You really can tell a lot from an animal just by looking into their eyes and, and see what they're feeling. And that's it for now for the Sheridan Valley Channel and Darren L. Zars. I'm Donna Bell, and we thank you for sharing a part of your day with us. Stay tuned. Another CVTV program is coming up shortly.